Hello everyone, back to another video, and in today's video, we'll be talking about the Battle of Bari, or the Siege, whichever one we want to call it. It was more, more of a siege, but the word, yeah, whatever. <clears throat> okay. The Byzantine Empire, or the Eastern Roman Empire, arguably the last of the empire, the last of the Roman Empire. Uh, at, at their height, they ruled bits of Hispania, almost all of North Africa, and all of Italy, the Balkan and the Balkans, and Egypt. But they they still dealt with the same problems of over, of of overextension, civil war, and nomads from the steppe. The Bulgarians, the Seljuk Turks, the Muslim Caliphate, the Rus, the Lombards, and also Crusaders at some point. All these all these factors affected the Eastern Roman Empire the most. Uh, for today, we will cover the the Normans or Vikings. The Norman conquest of Bari, the last Byzantine holdings in Italy, affected the duchy and, ex except for the duchy of Naples, but they're more of a vassal state, and they didn't have... look it up. The, the the siege began in 1068. And some battles around it shared around the city, but the Normans simply could not take the city. The Byzantines sent some reinforcements at twenty ships, but the Normans found them, and they were forced to withdraw. But somehow the supplies kept on kept on getting into Italy, only only until Bristindi fi finally fell. It began getting almost impossible to hold Bari, so they asked the Normans for terms, and they agreed to the surrender. And later on, the Byzantines under Emperor Manuel the First Comnenos in 1156 planned on retaking Italy, but it was failed. Uh, but it failed, and and of course, man and a effect of man's occurred, and they were stretched thin because man's occurred, and so they couldn't send reinforcements as many as they would have liked to relieve the city. And I feel like after the fall of Bari was truly the end point of the empire. It's like Constantinople, sure, that may have weakened them quite a hell of a lot, but you lose Italy, you're not really exactly a Rome. You need to hold something, I feel like, or at least Dalmatia. But you lose Bari, that's just... Dangerous point. And also, they landed in Epirus after the fact. The Normans. I remember hearing something about them fighting at Manzikert, the but I think that's kind of ridiculous for how where it's located and how the heck they would have gotten there. The Vikings were strong. They went far, but I don't think they could have gotten to Manzikert. It's when I looked at the maps, it was like just a desert essentially around that area. A desert and some mountains around Armenia and Georgia, so to get how they could have gone in, and yeah, so that is the Battle of Bari. Um, if you guys me, you guys want any interesting topics for me to cover, just tell me, and um, yeah. And so I have a, also before I posted a video, um, it didn't exactly work out how I wanted to. Uh, cause I accidentally got the wrong file. So, you guys saw that, um, sorry. Something inappropriate, it's just me saying I screwed your mom last night. Why do I even have that? Anyways, that'll be it for this video. I hope you guys have a nice rest of your day, and keep on loving history. Wait, wait, I, I, I really need a better one. I keep on loving history, it just sounds weird. Well, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.